superstar Rachel Weiss has revealed that despite being a successful actress and Cambridge graduate, she lets herself down on the home front. In a recent interview, she said, I don't have good home-making instincts. Uh, I'm working hard on it, especially now that I'm a mum. It's getting a little bit better, but it's just not me, to be honest. Um, but do you think that you have a duty, Linda Bellingham, to make yourself a good homemaker when you become a mum? Yes, I think you do. At least you should learn how to do it. I think, you know, it's like all these things. It goes to the other extreme... You know, I, God knows, uh, Rachel Weisz is a fantastic actress, brilliant career and all the rest of it. But I, I do think it's important that you, you follow perhaps most people's nesting in six females to, to, make a, to make a home for your children somewhere as a base. And if you, if you say, oh, but that, none of that's important, darling, in life, well, that little person might think it's very important. And I don't think you can give your child any better start in life and the security of coming home with to... with a Chinese takeaway or an Indian takeaway from... Well, <laughs> a, I, well A, you're missing out... Was that out, all week? Yeah, week. you're missing out on, I think, the joy of... I think part of the reason uh, cooking it, it has, you know, and in the home, if you like, has lost its appeal is people don't understand the joy, actually, of cooking well, I... for a family and watching your family sit down around a meal and eat we, it all we together. We sit down around the table. We have to take out the cartons and put the lids in. <laughs> <laughs> Joking. But I'm not joking, and we do, and we, but we do all sit around the table, and occasionally, um, I mean, I have to say, in my defence, Paul's been away for ten days in China, and put Bo and I have been in this hotel, so we we ate out most of the time, and we got back on Friday, and we've still been eating out. But um, yeah, but why are you but, so hopeless at all of that? Because, stuff? because first of all, when we first I got back at school, you're not that much younger than me, and I, I didn't I do no it. stage Did school. Did you not stage school? We didn't do domestic science. We didn't even do science because we didn't have a room for it. You see, so, that's where I think it's all gone wrong. Yeah, yeah I I think people. Think Bo is the different thing here is that Paul has taught Bo how to cook. Paul is an amazing cook, and whenever I endeavour to make anything, I can see they're sat there, look, you know, put forcing it down. Thinking, oh, it's a shame Dad didn't cook dinner tonight. You know, <laughs> <laughs> doesn't that make you, you want to get it's a shame, Yes, that you weren't taught. I, it's yes, no I big do. deal. It's yeah. not difficult. I would like and, to be able to cook. And I honestly think, and what amazes me is when when families talk now about the cost of, you know, food and or you know we live. Well, if you bought fresh stuff and cooked it, it'd be a hell of a lot cheaper than buying ready. Yeah. But the don't you, don't you... Yeah. 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 Absolutely true. And, really need to do all that sort of homemaking. I don't have kids or anything. Um, well, you've got Ma. Oh, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, yes. It's nice to do things well, for it's... people you love. Yes, it's it lovely is to nice, cook for. yeah. But, you know, I, I still don't do it. But the point is... <laughs> can you cook? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can. What he can does, you cook? He does it most of the time because he enjoys it much more than I do. Same I could cook anything. I could, I can make steak in your pudding and pies and Yorkshire puddings and everything because I've still got my domestic science folder from when I was at school. <laughs> and I tell you what, order a good pie online. No. And what you can do is, when you're having a dinner party, you can pick a pie per person. So if well, someone gets yeah, a chicken, why, someone gets a beef. In that? No, I, I think I, I think it's all going wrong now. I think the, the kids aren't learning how to do these yeah, things. Yeah. And it was all girls in my school, but in you know there was a school my friend went to where the girls did uh, domestic science and the boys did carpentry, that yes. sort of thing. <laughs> but I know it's got little diagrams about how to how to make a bed, how to air a bed, how to iron things, how, oh, to, do, how to use a twin tub. They learned... But you don't know how to use a twin I tub. <laughs> the reason I didn't cook was because I was doing the tidying up and unpacking and the washing, you and see. That, and that was another point I was going to make, because we focus very heavily on the cooking, but surely being a good homemaker is, is about the All whole of spectrum things. of, yes, of things. But I actually don't see why having a tidy house makes you a better mum. Surely, if you're more relaxed with not your, saying with that, your not kid... Saying it has to be tidy, but A, it has to be clean. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And if you don't teach your children what is the difference between clean and dirty, believe you me, you'll, they'll know it later in life when they haven't got anybody to sit with them in their smelly room. Um, <laughs> it, 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 it's a, I taught my sons to cook. Yeah. I taught my sons to be clean. I just think it's, it's not that anyway. It's home is where the heart is. It is. And if it's a lovely place to come back to. And I think it's gone out of fashion. And young women spend so much time now going out looking for rich husbands so they don't have to do anything. Oh, they Lindy should be Bellingham. at home making a nice oh, home for them. All in the belly. Yeah, well, wrong. Yes. My Paul's a lovely homemaker. <laughs> and we all do very well out yeah. of it. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> well, imagine what kind of.